Yo, what's up, guys? So, guess what just happened, man? They just nerfed completely into the ground the best unit in All Star Tower Defense. So, uh, that means we now have a new best DPS unit. So, uh, let's go take a look, guys, at the top two new best units, guys, in the game. All right, so first up, I forget what he's called. Oh, yeah, it's called this guy right here. So, we have Light Child, and then we also have our boy shining hero now before we hop into it don't forget to smash the subscribe button help us reach 500k subs to unlock our next code units all right right now we're thinking about whole horse and kana so if you guys like whole horse or kana let me know down below which one and vote in my community tab poll which one you want to see or you can recommend a different unit and don't forget to use star code blam all right here we go guys let's go smack on into infinite mode and take a look at our boy shining heroes massive nerf and take a look at what could potentially be the new best unit in all-star tower defense here we go all right here we go guys so let's first take a look at our boy shining hero now before we take a look at his new stats let's take a look at his pre-nerf stats and we can see what we are missing out on well actually this guy's been buffed and nerfed a gazillion times so uh, oh my gosh i literally just made this video too Oh my gosh, this was when my PC was down bad. Dang. All right, here we go, guys. So it looks like upgrade number three had... All right, it looks like 813k damage, 1.71, and then 16.7, guys. 16.7 million damage, 8 SPA, and 100 range. And that is, of course, guys, with no buff. All right, you see that? There's no buff on him. So let's go take a look at the new stats. All right, and take a look, see what they did to our boy. 85k, 813k. All right, so this looks like the same, and then we got 1.71 million. I think that's the same. Uh, let me double check. Uh, yeah, 1.71 million. So I guess that attack is the same. Oh wow! Then look at this, guys. Wow, look at that jump. It goes from uh, 1.71 million to 16.7 million. That's crazy. Now it looks like it goes from let's see here, 1.71 million. Wow, to 3.42. Look at that, guys. That is a massive, massive nerf right there. Dang, he still has the same range though and the same SPA. And then of course we can buff him all the way up to max. Cause I know a lot of you guys wanna see the max buff stats. 11.9 million for eight. All right, I think I buffed him here. All right, let's see here, there we go. Versus 58 guys. So it went from 58 million to 11 million. That is pretty insane. So that means he is no longer the best unit in the game for damage. It's actually going to be our boy Light Child. So if we take a look at Light Child's stats, take a look at this guy's 4.83 for 7 versus 3.42 for um, uh, 8. And you're going to see he also has a better cone as well with slightly, slightly less range. But what makes Light Child even better is the Spear of Death. Spear of Death is busted OP, guys busted op ability it's gonna do uh, 800 million damage all right let me go spawn a few enemies and we'll test it out all right oh yeah do you see that look at that 2.4 billion so that's because it hit three enemies so it's doing 800 million per enemy which is insane and if you factor all of that in that makes him the new highest dps unit in the game guys so uh f in the chat for shining hero i mean He's still really good considering how easy he is to get, but uh, it looks like the new GOAT is going to be our boy Lancer. So uh, make sure you guys go get him real quick. And also, this guy is hybrid too. Yeah, this guy's hybrid. Shining Hero is not. So uh, not only is Light Child the best unit in the game, he's also the best air unit in the game as well. So uh, I'll probably make a video on that a little bit later, but there you go, guys. Go get your hands on our boy Lancer.